Welcome students. Let us see a very interesting and important question from the topic time and work. This question has been asked in staff selection commission examination in the year of 2000. Here question is a man, a woman and a boy can complete a job in 3, 4 and 12 days respectively. How many boys must assist one man and one woman to complete the job in 1 by 4 of a day question is very clear so let us see the solution solution is very simple first of all we will calculate the amount of work done by one man and one woman in one by four of a day then second step will calculate that how much amount of the work is remaining is left which will be completed by boys in the same period of time 1 by 4 of a day okay so you see a man can complete a job in three days okay so what is the amount of job done by a man in one day 1 by 3 and in 1 by fourth day 1 by 3 into 1 by 4 means 1 by 12 okay so let us write here solution a man, a woman and a boy can complete a job in 3, 4 and 12 days respectively. So, we will uh, approach with the help of unitary method. Okay. So, one man's work in 3 days is 1. So, therefore, one man's work in one day is 1 by 3 and uh, one man's work in 1 by 4th of the day is 1 by 3 into 1 by 4 this is equal to 1 by 12. Similarly, one woman's work in 1 by 4 day will be how much this is number of days by a woman required to complete the job four days so in one day amount of work done will be one by four and in one fourth of the day one by four into one by four this is equal to one by 16 so therefore amount of work done by uh, by one man and one woman one man and one woman in one by four day is equal to how much sum of these two numbers so this is one by 12 plus one by 16 let us find the sum lcm will be 48 12 4 ja 48, 16 3 ja 48. This is equal to 7 by 48 part of one work has been completed by one man and one woman in 1 by 4 day. So, what is the remaining work which will be completed by the boys? So, therefore, remaining work, one complete work minus 7 by 48. So, 48 minus 7 by 48, this is equal to 41 by 48. This much amount of work has to be completed by boys in the same period of time, 1 by 4th of the day. So, we need to find out number of boys. Okay? So, now we know one boy can complete this work in 12 days ok it means that is in 12 days one work is 
completed by one boy. So therefore, in one by four days, one work is completed by by unitary method. In twelve days, one boy is required. So in one day, how many multiplied? You can twelve. So this is twelve boys will be required, and in one by four day. If time is less, number of boys will be more. Correct. So this will be four is equal to forty-eight boys for completing this work. But remaining work is forty-one by forty-eight. So therefore, in one by four days. 41 by 48 work is completed by 48 into 41 by 48. 48 is cancelled out. This is equal to 41 boys. This is the required number of boys. This is the answer. Here you keep a note here that in 12 days one boy can complete a work. So in one day, number of boys will increase. That's why we will multiply, not divide, as unitary method. Okay. So and in same period of time, one by four day, forty-one by forty-eight amount of work. Here it will be multiplied forty-eight by forty-one by forty-eight. So finally, we are getting number of boys required is forty-one. This is the correct answer. Fine. So students. Questions are very interesting, and this question is particularly very important. It has been asked in so many competitive examinations. Okay, so we need to do some more practice of the similar pattern or some other patterns of the this topic, time and war. So students, please remain in touch with these videos, and hope you might have subscribed my channel. If not, please do it immediately and share these videos with your friends also. And if you are enjoying learning mathematics with these videos if you are liking these videos then your likes are most welcome thank you very much wish you all the best